Yo, what is up guys? So for today, we're going to be talking about Destiny 2. Now specifically, we're going to be looking at my Titan in Season of the Hunt slash Beyond Light. But before we get into my Titan. So before we start with the video, I just wanted to let you guys know that a high percentage of people that watch my videos are not subscribed according to my analytics. So if you could do me a favor and subscribe, hit that bell notification. I would very much appreciate it if you like my content, if you like just me in general. That would really help me out. So on with the video. So with that out of the way, let's talk about my my Titan. So my Titan is uh my her stats are looking pretty gross. I'm gonna be re I'm gonna be real with you guys. This look is something I came up with a few weeks ago because I was like, I definitely don't want to have just like what I actually have been wearing because I'm not a big fan of it. Although I am a big fan of it, but I'm using I use pieces that I'm like I don't. All right, if I, I want if I want to be really honest, I did not want to showcase these three so far because these three specifically the the mark is something I'm always going to have on my 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 Titan. If you go if you guys know last or the last video I did for my Hunter, we talked about uh this cloak right here, the Neoteric uh Kiat. This is my favorite cloak for my for my hunter. He always has that, like all the time. Never takes it off. This is the equivalent to that cloak. This mark is my favorite mark in the whole fucking game. So, this is gonna be a warning. Just know that if in the future I make another, an, oh, I'm gonna make all I make I make these week uh, seasonal, but. Just know that I'm most likely wearing this all the time instead of the actual mark that I that I show. Unless I actually say, actually, I love this mark and I'm wearing it a lot. So not only that, I think the boots are dope as fuck. I ended up buying this from Eververse when uh, Christmas came because I had a few pieces of it left. And it was just like, what was it 2000 Bright Dust? So I was like, fuck it for this and other pieces, obviously. And the chest piece, I don't think I've ever showcased this, sh this chest piece. This chest piece is from the uh, from the Season of Dawn Eververse armor set. Or no, 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 not the Eververse, I'm sorry. This is from the Season Pass. This is the Eververse uh, armor set, which I, I hate. And then, so if you guys are wondering, well, what, what did you really look like? This is actually my look right here. So I don't think it's bad. I think it's just the helmet itself, because if I'm being honest, this is the look, which grand looks, but I've already used this helmet. So I didn't want to, you know, my rule is I don't want to use a piece that I've already used in the past. And I was thinking about just using this and being like, well, I haven't used this one technically, but I, I don't want to be a dildo about it. So this is really how I've looked. But like I said, I thought this was so cool that I wanted to showcase this. Not only that, I still think Mask of the Quiet one is good. It's not like bad, bad, but it could use a buff if, if I'm being honest. So let's, we're going to look at my old look mostly because that is my build that I'm going for. So as you guys can see, mobility is at 20. Don't really need mobility for my Titan. At least I don't care. Uh, 90 for resilience. I know a lot of people are not rocking high resilience, but on my Titan, I kind of have to. Like, I don't understand why Titans don't rock high mobile or high resilience. Look at my top, like tier 10 is 14 seconds. Uh, I, that's probably why I was like, ah, whatever. I'm not going for a hundred. If I can just like, it's, it's like a three second, uh, difference. Fuck it. I don't care. 90 in recovery. Obviously I wish my grenade was higher. Honestly. I would much rather switch out my melee to grenade just because grenades a lot more useful and then my intellect at 50 which is like the sweet spot in my opinion because if you guys don't know intellect really spikes up at 50 and then after that it's diminishing returns so 50 for me is like the good spot anything else is just wasteful uh i think i said on my hunter video that i have 80 on her on, on him but i would prefer to have that reduced to 50 or 60 if i remember correctly and then all the other stats go to grenade or something else. So this is pretty much my build. Uh, as you guys can see, this is gonna this is gonna sunset next next week, dog. Oh my fucking god, I'm gonna get mad, dude. But this is gonna sunset next next week, which is gonna be annoying. Other than that, I, everything's pretty good for about a year, or a little under a year actually. 
for weapons themselves, I was using all the weapons that I used for my my hunter. Like all the weapons that my hunter used, I switched to my warlock and titan as well. But I do have Eye of Soul, which is one of my favorite weapons from Trials. This actually allowed me to pop off. I remember in specifically one match of just random control and it was really gross because I was just destroying people with my sniper. I'll probably have some gameplay of it a little bit. If not, I'll probably use it someday. Uh, Hawkmoon, I ended up getting a range master or a range perk on it. I have a few rolls on it. I might review this weapon mostly because I probably should review it. And then Fell Winters, every, each character has a Fell Winters like all the time. Like I will never not have a Fell Winters on my Titan or on any of my, my classes until I get Sunset. Uh, Posterity, one of my god rolls for PvE, which has Rapid Hit and One For All. And then Ancient Gospel, which I'm pretty sure, oh, Rapid Hit and Swashbuckler. I have three Rapid Hits and Kill Clips. And then Trophy Hunter that unfortunately is getting Sunset next week. And then a Stars and Shadow with, with Kill Clips. Kill clip and quick draw, which is really gross. I've this has put a lot of work for me. And then last but not least, falling guillotine with pretty much just stuff. I have the raid exotic, as you guys know. I've done multiple videos explaining that I have this, but it's pretty cool. And I am still going for the cabal themed stuff for my Titan. And it's funny because we finally have tight or Titan Cabal or Titans have Cabal themed armor. But as you guys know, I don't like to use all like a big full set of an armor set. Don't get me wrong, I'll do it like when I'm chilling or like just playing by myself. Because my Titan usually does look like this, but occasionally I'll be like, I kind of want to wear like all of this for this week. So I think I should have that. No, I don't. I have, to, I have to clean out my, my Titan stuff. But yeah, that's pretty much my Titan, guys. I, If you want to talk about builds, again, I have more of a... Uh, let's look at it, actually. So I have more of a Charge with Light build. I like Charge with, with Light a lot more. Mostly because it's something that I don't have to really think about most of the time. So... This is actually a build that I was going going for when I was trying to do the solo flawless for the for the Hawkmoon mission, but unfortunately I already did it that week, so I had to do it on my hunter. But yeah, that's pretty much it. Let me know what you guys think in the comments below. This is gonna be a short video because honestly, it's not much to talk about. Uh, my the reason my hunter is the one that usually takes the longest is because we go through all the weapons and all the stuff. And I don't do that with my other classes, mostly because, again, I use most of the weapons that are... Actually, I need to go to the tower anyways, but... Yeah, let me know what you guys think. What you, what, are you, what have you guys been rocking for your class in this season? Let me know in the comments below. If you want to follow me on my social media, all links are in the description below. Thank you, everyone, for the support. I really do appreciate it. And other than that, I'll see you guys later.